So a less common feature on the MagnaMic is saving the data to the internal data logger. So you can build a file on the instrument and then save the thickness readings to that file. And if you'd like, you can then transfer the file into WinXcel. Um, so normally you're single sending live thickness readings, but you do have the ability to do a file transfer if you'd like. So once you've established connection with the MagnaMic in the WinXcel program, you can click Communications and then choose Receive Data File from Gauge. So you want to make sure that the Gauge directory is found. So right now there's a file on my instrument called No Name 00. That's a default file that will always be on the instrument, but if you had any other file names that you created, they should be listed under Gauge Directory. So if it's not showing your file names, you'd want to click Receive Directory, but it's showing here that it, that's already completed. So then I would choose the file that I want to import. So I click that and then choose Receive Data File. So now I'm going to select my formatting before I add it to Excel. So you can use the existing spreadsheet. If you don't click that, it's going to open up a new Excel spreadsheet. You can choose where you want the data to be sent. Um, if you want column headings, which I like, also units. Also how you want it to be formatted. And then you can click Add to Excel. So this is just confirming that you're overwriting an existing spreadsheet, which I want. So I'm going to click Yes. And you should get a pop-up letting you know that the data was received. So you can click OK. And then click Close. So here I have all my thickness readings with the units.